In Luke 24, word that Jesus' body was no longer in the tomb is beginning to spread like wildfire. In verse 13, we meet two men who are talking about this on their way out of town to Emmaus. Now we know that they had been followers of Christ, and we know that they had hoped that Jesus was the Messiah, but their faith had been shaken. After seeing Jesus crucified, he no longer fit their vision of what the Messiah would be. Now as these men were walking, Jesus came alongside them and began to talk to them, only they didn't know it was him. During their conversation, Jesus uncovered the problem with their faith. They simply didn't know the scriptures. So, on this journey, Jesus began to explain the prophecies and how it was foretold that the Messiah would suffer these things and enter into his glory. Then when Jesus finally revealed who he was to them, they not only knew him, but they knew that he was the Messiah and he had risen. But verse 32 is one of the coolest verses to me. They said to each other, didn't our hearts burn within us as he talked with us on the road and explained scriptures to us? I mean, what an experience, right? To have Jesus explain scriptures and reveal himself to you? Well, I have some great news. If you're a child of God, you can experience this every time you read the Bible. That's what Paul explains in 1 Corinthians 2. For his spirit searches out everything and shows us God's deep secrets. No one can know a person's thoughts except that person's own spirit. And no one can know God's thoughts except God's own spirit. 